Konnichiwa, Miami Gamers, Jeremiah, the Anime Boy Heel, and welcome back to Genshi Impact. Today, guys, there's a 1.6 update where we're gonna be with Klee again and special quest <sighs> we're going to. So, okay. Steiner! Start this episode, I'm gonna wish for Klee! Because why the fuck not? Give me Klee, give me. Already? That's like one second! Holy Jesus! I'm just gonna click away to see what. Oh, finally! I got Klee! That was one wish! One wish! And I got Bible and Sucrose. Like, I already have them, my team. Why would you give me another. Should I wish for another one? Nah, let's just go. Weapons. I mean, just why not? It would. Uh, that's purple. I got two weapons of each, except for the last two. Okay! Oh, isn't it great? I got clear my team! Oh, so heavy! Uh, then how the fuck are you carrying that with those little ass legs? Anyways, Klee, you are home! Home to me! I got two children in my team now! Don't say the L word in my comment, please. Here's something cool too, there's a teapot mission we could do too. If we have time today, I will do that too. So, we'll do the mysterious island journey to the unknown. So go to Knights of Fulfillment's headquarters, long time no Klee. Let's go visit her at Knights of Fulfillment's headquarters. Look at him. Klee? I mean, she's right there, I saw her. There she is, over there. Klee, we haven't seen you in forever. Are you okay? Oh, it's Mr. Honorary Knight and Pymore. I miss you. <laughs> I was just about to go find you two. What's the matter? I got a terrible, terrible letter. I need to go to a certain place. A certain place? A letter? Yes. From a person that won't acknowledge that Klee and Do the core family. They even said they want to test Klee and have Klee go to Dodo Land, but... but Dodo Land? There's no need to rush. Slow down. Who is this person that you're talking about? A very bad, bad, bad guy. He's called Dodo King. Who's Dodo King? Paimon also hasn't heard of him? Nope. Wait, why did you say also? Because even Klee has never heard of him. Ah, uh, he's probably just some weirdo. I went to go find Albedo, but he's not home, so I thought of you. Aww. Let me read you the letter that Dodo King wrote. <clears throat> Wicked girl of flame, I am of the Dodo clan. Uh... Clay can't read this part. Oh, no worries, child. In the name of Dodo King, you are not qualified to become Dodoko's new family. <laughs> Unless you bring Dodoko to the Golden Apple Archipelago, life for, uh, accept the, um, oh, Clee. I don't know some of these words. Can I read instead? Let Paimon have a look. Give. What does it say? This word is Overlord, which means he's the most powerful guy around, and what he says goes. This part reads, Light four beacons and knock upon the trial escape. Hmm. Probably to accept some kind of challenge. The last word is Arbitrate, which, uh... Uh, which means he wants to judge you! Okay... Um... um Arbor... Tree? Uh, it's nothing good anyway. He'll judge and criticize you while pretending to be the good guy. It sounds like he wants you to return Dokoko. How could this be? Dodoko is my bestest friend, so I'll never give Dodoko to him. But... He said he's the strongest of the Dodo clan. Could the Dodo clan be Dodoko's family? From the names, it seems like it. But Klee, where is this Golden Apple Archipelago? I don't know. What? Well, this is also the first time Klee has heard of the Golden Apple Archipelago. Golden Apple Archipelago. Hmm. It's probably an island with lots of apples. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, the only things written on the letter were what Klee just read out to us. And there's no signature. 
Klee, did this letter come with an envelope? I'm gonna say yes. No? Never mind! Where was the set from? I don't know, it suddenly appeared on my room's window, so... Dodo King, Dodo Clan... If Paimon remembers correctly, Dodo Ko is the toy hanging on Klee's backpack, right? No, Dodo Ko is my bestest friend, not some toy. Oh, right, what a magical creature Dodo Ko is. Uh, but all this sudden talk about family and whatnot is pretty strange. It feels like it might be a prank. I always suspected it's a prank. If it's just a prank, then we should ignore it. No, no way! I'll never admit defeat. I have to go there. But we've never even heard of such a place. Mr. Honorary Knight, you know what to do, right? Clee believes in you. Of course! Even if we did know what to do... Uh, I'm begging you, please, please help me. My mom feels like if we don't agree to help, she'll go off on her own. That'd be dangerous. Indeed. Rather than letting Clee go adventuring off by herself, it'd be better if we accompany her. Oh, please, please! I'll help you. Uh, how can we say no after seeing you try so hard? But since we're going together, you need to be well behaved and not run off by yourself. Okay. As per usual, let's start by asking around for some info. I don't know if you know. Let's walk around the city and ask some people who might know something about the situation. Yeah, let's go. Ask the Russian guy first. Do you know anything? At all? Maybe, I don't know who is. Cyrus, we want to ask you about a place. You know it, won't you? Won't you? Oh? <laughs> the little adventurer looks troubled. Have you all encountered some sort of problem? Uh, you could say that. Basically, we want to find a certain archipelago, but it seems no one's ever even heard of it. So we came here to ask you, a seasoned adventurer. Um, uh, certainly so charming, Paimon. <laughs> if you seek unknown lands or adventuring knowledge, then you've come to the right man. What kind of archipelago are you all looking for? It has lots of small islands on the sea. Okay. It's called the Golden Apple Archipelago. Golden Apple Archipelago? Uh, mm. It sounds unfamiliar to him. <laughs> You're all amazing. You've managed to find a place that even I, the great Cyrus, haven't heard of. What? Even you don't know of it? Indeed, indeed. The land of Tevat is immense. No person can walk its entire breadth. But do not fear, dear friends. You must have the courage to venture into the unknown. Who would have thought that even Cyrus, the branch master of the Adventurers Guild, wouldn't know anything? Could it be that these islands don't exist? Sure, some coincidence a moment ago. <laughs> Come now, don't be like that. Oh, how can this be? Oh, don't go. What about her? I mean, I don't know what she knows. There's no way she knows. Marjorie here might have heard some strange things. After all, souvenirs do come in all shapes and sizes from a variety of places. That's not true. Strange things? What do you mean? Do you know about the Golden Apple Archipelago? It's made up of lots of small islands and located somewhere in the sea! <laughs> Aren't all archipelagos made of small islands and situated at sea? That's right. Oh, uh, right. Uh, then let Paimon ask a different question. Are there archipelagos in Mondstadt? Not as far as I know. I don't think so. You've seen a map of Mondstadt, haven't you? All known islands are already charted, so check it out. Generally speaking, maps will faithfully record the land's topography. For most people, if it's not on a map, it doesn't exist. Mondstadt's map doesn't show any, so that must mean there are none. A place that doesn't exist? Ugh, sounds about right. <laughs> How could that be? Oh, don't cry, don't cry! No, no, no! Uh, Paimon meant that we should go find other people to ask. Oh, cry, Klee. You're making me cry.
Why are we asking Huffman? I don't know if he knows. There's probably no way he knows. Mr. Huffman, do you know about the Golden Apple Archipelago? It's on the sea. A Golden Apple Archipelago on the sea? Uh, this is the first I've heard of it. Are they islands that grow many apples? Mm, so you also don't know? No. Well, given that Huffman's always just patrolling the city. <sighs> I do apologize. It's okay. I forgive you. Are you gonna kill the man next later on? Clee, he hasn't actually apologized. Huh? Really? Uh, let's go ask someone else. Wait! What do you mean he wasn't actually apologizing? That makes no sense. Looks like the people of Mondstadt don't know anything about the place in this letter. Feels more and more like a prank to me. Clee, is there anyone you can think of that you don't get along with? Would there be anyone who'd write a letter to scare you? No, I love everyone very much, and everyone loves Clee very much. Aww, aww, mm -hmm. we do too. I don't think so too. So it can't be a prank. Hmm. Um, no, we'll be free. Hmm. It's not a prank, yet no one knows where these islands are. Ugh, this is getting more and more confusing. Is this song even more knowledgeable to we could ask? Knowledgeable. <gasps> right! What about Jean or Lisa? We should ask Lisa about this kind of thing. She's at the library every day and has probably read every book in Mondstadt. Oh, Miss Lisa! Let's go to the library! Oh yes, mommy! Is Lisa right here? Okay, where is she? Where is she? <gasps> mommy! Lisa, mama, I miss you, lady, yes! Oh my god, I miss Lisa! Lisa. Are you busy? Oh, well, if it isn't cutie, Paimon, and Klee. What brings you to the library all of a sudden? There's something we want to ask you. Miss Lisa, can you help Klee find an arch uh, archipelago? An archipelago? Oh no, Don't she's probably doesn't know. Don't Klee to go to the Golden Apple Archipelago so he can challenge Klee. Don't worry, Klee. Let Paimon explain. Lisa, it's like this. This child's drugged! You tell at least everything that you know about Lily and the Apocalypse. Uh, Let me get this straight. To determine if Klee is worthy of becoming Dodoko's family, the ruler of the Dodo clan, Dodo King, wrote a letter to Klee summoning her to this Golden Apple Archipelago to be judged. Does that sum it up? Yes, I have to go! And you, cuties, sought me out to help Klee find the location of this Golden Apple Archipelago, correct? That's why, right, yo. You're one of the smartest people on Mondstadt. <laughs> How sweet of you to say. Then I have no choice but to assist you in earnest. Oh? Klee, can you show me that letter? Okay. You go. Yeah, I'll give you your hand, Klee. Hmm. Though there's little information written upon the letter, have you all tried any other methods? Other methods? Wait, I don't think the so. The letter contains faint elemental traces that seem more like a hint than anything else. Maybe try using your elemental sight. Alright! Why didn't we think of that? Let's take a look! Alright, look at my eyes. Like, <laughs> Did you find anything? Snap is on the back of the letter. Most of the content on the reverse page was applied via elemental power. What an interesting approach. Here's a pen. Cutie, can I trouble you to copy down what you see with your elemental sight? It's a deal, though! But Klee's a child! You just get him to see with the elemental sight. Dad! Oh! We can see- Look, it's golden! Are we gonna go there? The information on the reverse page is now clear. This drawing is likely of the golden apple archipelago you've been looking for. A ton of small islands floating by themselves in the water without being anchored to any land. It's almost like they popped up from the seabed. Like they appeared out of thin air. Hmm. Paimon, you might be right. I don't understand what you mean. I've read every single book within this library's walls. Similar islands have been mentioned in some of them. A mysterious archipelago enveloped by storms and dense fog, belonging to no nation. That which is outside cannot enter, nor can anything inside leave. Only those who are chosen may enter its territory. 
Many years ago, a fleet from Mondstadt encountered some islands at sea. Reportedly, there were torrential rains and howling winds. The sailors could hardly discern land through the thick fog. The islands weren't far, but no matter how much they sailed, they never grew closer. The sailors were initially confused, but then became terrified, as they believed they were hallucinating. Whoa! Talk about mysterious and creepy! Unfortunately, the books do not record the location of these islands. I'm afraid that if you want more information, you'll have to find someone more knowledgeable than I. Oh, man. Uh, and Paimon thought Lisa would be the expert on this kind of thing. I am but a librarian who prefers to stay inside with her books. Klee, do you really want to go to those islands? It might be a very scary place. Yes, I want to go. She got us. We're fine. <laughs> My, how brave. Far be it from me to scare a child. But Klee, you really should take someone with you, just in case. Someone reliable, like my cutie over here. Klee, you're not scared? She's definitely screaming inside. I'm scared, but not being able to be Dodoko's family is even scarier. Dodoko is very important to me. I won't lose to Dodo King. I'll need to ask for some time off so I can go to the Golden Apple Archipelago and find Dodo King. Time off? That's right. I'm a knight of Favonius. Master Jean told me that if Clee wants to go someplace far, then she has to ask for time off. You're going to ask for time off. Now? We still don't even know where these islands are! Cutie, judging by the look on your face, you have an idea, don't you? I have some impressive friends and Mondstadt. It'll be up to you to get Jean's approval. I'll stay here and silently cheer for you all while enjoying a book and some tea. Yay! Hey, Master Jean! Can I go? Fuck no! Why the fuck not? You killed too many fishes! You killed too many fishes! Kill a boy, what? But she's a child! Oh my. oh my god, what is Barbara doing here with Jean? This is whale. Oh god, look how she went. Because I want to go somewhere. Clee? Oh, and it's the honorary knight in Paimon as well. I... It's been a while, everyone. How have you been? Oh my god, it's Paimon! Paimon's also here? How rare. Do we have a sisterly moment? <clears throat> oh, uh, of course not. Sus! Hey, why are you requesting time off all of a sudden? Clee's going to the Golden Apple Archipelago to meet the Dodo King, or else... Or else you'll take Dodoko away. Dodo King? Take Dodoko away? <laughs> Just show the letter, my god! That Klee is worthy of being part of Dodoko's family. I need to prove myself. Mr. Honorary Knight will help me, right? Traveler, Paimon, is this so? Klee spoke the truth. I've never heard of the Golden Apple Archipelago. Where is it? I've also never heard of it. Yes. Yeah, Me either. But Miss Lisa said that someone must know. So it's a place that even Lisa doesn't know? Yes, but I have a hunch. I see. From what you say, it seems to be quite a mysterious place. I sincerely apologize, but I cannot approve Knight Klee's request for time off. Huh? But why? I must go! Don't be angry. Even if these mysterious islands do exist, we cannot determine if they are safe or not. I cannot allow you to journey into a potentially dangerous place. But if I don't go, Dodoko will be taken away. I I don't want to lose Dodoko. Oh, Klee. Moreover, how do you intend to reach the islands? Without a safe and reliable plan drawn up, I'm afraid I cannot give you my approval. Don't cry, don't cry! Psst. Honorary knight! Huh? <gasps> Miss Paul looking at me! Oh, she did look at me! Like, bitch, let's have sex. Outside! Oh! What the? Can you think of a way to get to the islands? Oh, I'm gonna be sneaky! Vanty might know the way. Paimon also thought of him just now. We're on the same wavelength, as expected. Venti? Oh, he's a magical bard that Paimon calls Tone Deaf Bard. Can he help me? He's our friend, so will definitely help. If he's a friend of the Honorary Knights, then things will work out for sure. We all know how reliable the Honorary Knight is. How about this? I'll try to persuade Master Jean. 
You all know she's a serious person, so I think it might take some time. Klee, trust me, okay? I'll do everything I can to help you. Okay, I can wait. <laughs> Wonderful. Tomorrow afternoon, let's all meet at the plaza outside the cathedral. I'm sure I'll have some good news. Just leave it to me. You're so dependable. Do your best, Barbara. Oh, it makes me happy to see Bob with us. It's so cool. Time. Let's meet up with Barbara and Klee at the plaza. I was literally changing time off camera for a second, Paimon. Like, that was weird. What I to do? Oh, Jean came. Yay. At least good. You happy? Awake. Yawn. We're all here now. Oh, everyone, over here. Mr. Honorary Knight, Paimon. Greetings. All oh, Mastery is also here. Yes, it's a long story. Barbara and Lisa have both spoken to me, and there is something that I have realized. Regardless if I approve it or not, Clee will go where she wants to anyway. This is how it has always been. Aww. Oh, Clee, don't be so young, Debbie. We all know Clee. Rather than have her run headlong into danger, it's better to agree to her request. Yeah, that's My what I thought. Clee, your request for leave has been approved. Wow, I'm so excited! However, there are conditions. In exchange, I will be accompanying everyone to this letter's Golden Apple Archipelago. As for the Knight's affairs, I have entrusted them to Kaya. Work has been busy and I shouldn't leave, but I wouldn't be able to stop worrying about Klee. So, please allow me to travel with you. Yay! Oh, there won't be any problems if Master G comes with us. Big Sis, uh, I mean, Master Jean also suggested oh, come on. along. Barbados forbid, but I can assist if someone needs medical treatment during our journey. Just call her sis! It's okay! She's not Kyle sis! We're so lucky to have Barbara too! Miss Barbara, Master Jean, you two are so nice! I promise I'll behave! Clee, you always say that. I hope you will abide by your words this time. Uh, <laughs> Lisa oh, heard that I one. wanted to accompany everyone to the islands, so she prepared this pouch. Supposedly, opening it will reveal a new way. New way? You mean a way to keep Klee out of trouble? She said not to open it until we've reached the islands. I think it might be something to use in case of an emergency. Uh, as expected of Miss Lisa, she's been thinking of us this whole time. Anyway, our next step is to find the bard, right? I just asked the people nearby. They said that he hasn't performed at the square today and that he likely went to Windrise. What are we waiting? Let's head to Windrise and find Tonga's bar! Fenty! I have it my team too. Hey! It's the boy I simp for so long! Hi, Venti! What's up, buddy? What's up, buddy? Venti, we found you! Hmm? There's what? so many people are looking for me, then I suppose it is something important. Venti, do you know of the golden apple? Apple a cup This is the map of the islands! Ah, oh, yes, that place. <laughs> Congratulations! You found the right person! Seriously? Wow, wow, wow! You really do know! So, now they're called the Golden Apple Archipelago, huh? They used to be known as the Har Islands. They're located on a stretch of sea that's particularly difficult for the average person to reach. Dang. Not to mention, the area has strong storms and thick fog year-round. Why well, the slimes? hardly approach the island, let alone dock. Why do you guys wish to go there? I'm going there to meet Dodo King. He said he wants to test Klee to see if she's qualified to be Dodo King's family. Hmm. Are you nervous? A little, but I will not give in. Master Tone Deaf Bard, you must help us. Master Tone Deaf Bard? <laughs> Interesting. I like it. How about you about influence? Is fault? Yeah! Fear not. Since you wish it so, Master Tone Deaf Bard will lend a helping hand. Could you really help us? <laughs> of course! In this world, what is more pure and free than the wish of a child? Oh, play this music. What a beautiful sound! Dang, I know that. Is the wind picking up? What's going on? Wait just a moment. He'll be here soon. Oh, is the dragon? Uh, that's... Uh, 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 
This is a secret between us here. So don't tell us. Okay. Oh, my dear poet, you have my utmost gratitude for the aid you have provided us. Uh -huh. The acting grandmaster sure is formal. We know you have a way, Venti. <laughs> what wonderful expressions you all have. I'll see you off here. May the winds bless your travels. Oh, we'll all be. Whee! Am I gonna die? Don't scream in my face. Dang. Wait, 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 wait. What is going on here? Is this Izuma? This is as far as I go. Oh, okay. It would be cumbersome for me to proceed further. Please, exercise caution. Oh, I Devalin. Open your eyes. Whoa, this place gave me chills! Oh my god, this place is cool. What are we exactly? Wow! But you could fly. That was my first time riding on a dragon's back. My, my heart won't stop pounding. Can you just hug? Is everyone all right? Yes. Yes, I'm fine. Big uh, Master Jean, just who is that? Boy? Oh my God! Just say Big Sis, please, please, please. It's okay. She seems fine with it. Well, uh. He's a legendary bard of exceptional musical talent who can use his lyre to call forth all manner of creatures. Uh, Even Master Jean is pretty quick on the spot. That's fancy though. Immensely skillful for managing so to fuck oh, fuck. What an impressive person. We must properly thank him when we return. Agreed. In any case, what are these islands? The weather is dreadful, the fog is thick, and visibility is low. Just like Lisa said. We should be extra careful. Traveler, Paimon, what else does the letter say? Oh, Paimon remembers. It read, Wicked Girl of Flame, I am of the Dodo Clan as its overlord. In the name of Dodo King, you are not qualified to become Dodo Ko's new family. Unless. Unless. You bring Dodoko to the Golden Apple Archipelago, light the four beacons, and knock upon the trialist gate to accept your challenge. Four beacons? Does that mean he wants us to find something that emits light? Now that you mention it, doesn't it seem like it's a little less foggy here than the surrounding area? Looking carefully, that indeed appears to be the case. Could the clearing of the fog be related to this device? Oh. Don't you think it looks familiar? Pretty similar to the portable waypoints we've used before. Crafting portable waypoints requires luminescent spines, so they can also function as a source of light. So if this device here seems like it can dissipate fog, maybe it's a similar kind of device. I think so too. Light four beacons and knock upon the trialist gate. Hmm. What will happen after we light up all four beacons? There's already one lit device here. It appears that we need to find the other three and light them up as well. Huh? What's that? There's another one. Glee? Careful! Hey! Don't run off! Ugh, come on, catch up to her! Glee! Oh, looks like something's down there! Let's take a closer look. I'll be careful for you! Like, wow, let's go to the boiling point. Hey, look, it's a boat! Why is that going? But the general's a good guy! He protects us! Huh? I've told you, it's too dangerous! Hey! Where are you running off to? Whoa! Okay, that's interesting! I see a boat. Oh, a boat! What can we do with this boat though, by the way? That makes me wonder. Hmm. A boat? Hmm. It looks as if someone has been awaiting our arrival. Are we really supposed to sail in such terrible weather? I'm afraid that appears to be the intention. Everyone, everything about these islands is a mystery. Regardless of what lies ahead, please proceed with utmost caution. Oh, okay, Jean. 
The way it's famous is well above the wheel that can be sold to a skipper used using a window waypoint. Get close to the waypoint to board it set sail. You can summon from the wind waypoint at a time, but one person can only own the windmill. Dang, windmill can occur to increase the speed. Windmill also are also armed with two different weapons. The strike wave with heavy and heavy cannons. The heavy cannons are more firepower, but go on cold and for being after being fired. After her jump button to stop sailing and leave the waypoint. After leaving your waypoint, you can get closer to again to start sailing or using the waypoint with summon you decide one more. So we just press this. Alright, that's unlocked. So we're gonna find three and set sail. Wow, this is cool. So do I follow the lights? I should be careful. I don't wanna die. Oh, fuck was over the surface. It's just time going apple. Because you get careless and you might get lost. Good because it floats to the ocean surface. It couldn't light the way. When you're still close to the green of beacon, you know I'm not gonna read. Not gonna read. I'm just gonna go follow the path. Ow. What happens if I crash into this? Probably- <laughs> Holy trolls! Oh hell no! You know what? Die! 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 Come on to dying! You slow! You're a bitch! Yeah, drown to hell, I don't care. You know what? It shouldn't hurt to even go heal. There you go. I was trying to get out. Like literally, it was confusing. I mean, y'all die quick anyways. You go away. And goodbye. Oh, you look alone, but who cares? You're gonna die anyways. And everything else, you just go and suffer. Drown, bitch. Am I actually supposed to follow these instead of. Wow, that's just. I'm supposed to follow these instead of actually doing my own thing? Why? There was like what I saw on the map! Like, are you serious? Are you just gonna help me with anything else? I don't know if there's gonna do anything. I'm just gonna keep walking forward. Because I don't know where else to go. Is that one? It looks like one. I feel like that's one out of three and I haven't found yet in this episode. Like da 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 the next beacon. The next beacon is like, ooh, some island. I should be careful because I don't know if. Oh, 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 I see one, I see one, I see one. Okay, okay, okay. I'm just gonna fly off and land down, activate, and wow, you guys. I'm just gonna kill all. Come to me. Hey, look, a shell. Let's listen carefully. How time flies. In the blink of an eye, I've grown old. Oh, hello, darling. Come to Grandma. Oh, goodness. Someone's growing up fast, aren't they? You're not a small child anymore. Now, what do you think this might be? <laughs> It's a family heirloom. Grandma's ancestors brought it with them when they came here many years ago. Today, Grandma is giving it to you. Take it, and remember this nursery rhyme. One river flowing down the middle. Hmm, that seems interesting. So, have I found all of the devices yet? Because I'm confused. It says 0 3. Goodness. Okay, let's go this way next, and this area looks like it's above. Oh, gotta be careful. I mean, why has to be above? That makes no sense. Okay, I'm gonna go up. And be careful. Like, do 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 do. Oh, there's enemies here. Are you kidding me? I don't wanna deal with you. Oh, what the fuck? I mean, I leave fell and he just literally just falls down. The next waypoint is above. And I'm climbing. Wow. Entertainment. <sighs> no, it's not. Okay, another one. Hey, guess what? Grandma gave me a gift. Do you want to see it? Here. Grandma says it comes from the world. 
world outside. Uh, she says our ancestors brought it to the island when they first came here. Oh, and she taught me a nursery rhyme too. Um, I think it goes like this. Four winds bring the sound of joy. Hmm, four winds sounds of joy, huh? Yeah, let's go try boat. Where are we going? I'm getting kind of scared, honestly. <laughs> this dark atmosphere we're fl flowing around? Like, please, is this even a good idea being here? It's scaring me! Oh, look, we found something. But I should be careful. Like, where is the waypoint here? Ooh. You know, this happens, island. A shell! Interesting finding! Listen. I've seen it with my own eyes! People disappear into the fog and never return! So please, do not put yourself in danger! The next waypoint is like right here. And there's probably a reason to buy here too, so I'm gonna be careful. Okay, the waypoint is right there. Oh, move out of way, plant! I don't want to smoke your face, you know? That's two out of three. <laughs> Hey! Wow, look at this island. Is this even... No, I can't say for sure this is the island I'm thinking about. The surrounding area is gradually becoming clearer! Let's go and find the last one! And then after that, I'm gonna episode. Hmm... Oh, where do we go from here? Exactly. No! Whoa! What is that? What is that? I'm not gonna go to near you! Nope, I'm fine. Thank you very much. Ow. I'm just gonna pass up the castle. I mean, pass by the Hurricane's base because I don't want to waste my time on that. I would rather find the three at the end episode. It's getting kind of long. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, I gotta make sure because I don't want to get lost. I'm like, where the fuck is the other one? Okay, I'm going. Okay, that's the uh, next island. Why are you playing peaceful music? It looks scary! Why? It's scary as fuck! Where are we going? Oh, I see another waypoint already. Interesting. I'm gonna go for it. Because just why not? I'm gonna fly up. Alright, see you guys up there. Whee! Alright, next <laughs> waypoint, open up! Like, dang, look at this location. Wait, we're going back there. Okay, just for this part of the zone, then we're done. Getting tired. Alright, standing up to the sky. Alright, how's everything? The fog's gone! Oh, it's actually pretty scenic here! The four beacons have been lit, but we still don't know what trials may lie ahead. <sighs> the weather's so nice. I know we can't afford to drop our guard, but I can't help but enjoy the summer. I want to catch fish! Klee, this isn't Mondstadt. Please be <laughs> careful. Oh, I understand. Paimon, after we deal with Dodo King together, we can go catch some fish! Okay, sure! Whatever you say! Who or what exactly is Dodo King? Yes, it is Yes, it is also my first time here. This may not sound fair to Klee, but my primary duty is to protect everyone. Finding this overlord is secondary. Also, the sudden appearance of this letter, these islands that are inaccessible by ordinary people, it's too much of a coincidence. Why would this sort of invitation be sent to a child? That's weird. It's truly unbelievable. I also mustn't be careless. Well, what are we all waiting for? Let's start exploring the area! Carefully and wait to explore classic Paimon. Paimon's right. We should take advantage of the clear weather to reassess our situation. Even on a mysterious island, I have no worries as long as you're here. <sighs> so, should we go swimming first? Now? Barbara is always happy-go-lucky when she sees such beautiful scenery. Traveler, please feel free to explore. I'll be at the ready if there's any sign of danger. I hope this island doesn't give us too much trouble. Yeah. Hey, what have we done? I didn't think we'd be done that quick. So that's the first part of the episode. In the main can, make ready, fire. Charles, Charles, take test. I'm not gonna read. It's too tiring to read this. Honestly. 
And we got dual poles. Dang. Hey, look! You know what? I might consider doing this next episode for you guys. I'll say next episode, I'll do that for you guys. I mean, it looks fun. So I'm gonna go ahead and end it for you guys because that's pretty much it for you guys. Sayonara!